And in, in, in office in terms of Poland, would you look outside core kind of CBD in, in Warsaw? Are you looking to other cities or is it really just, just Warsaw? No, for Poland it would be just Warsaw and they're just CBD and Mokotov probably. Um, so really also just the best locations and this is also true for the Nordics where it would be Helsinki and Stockholm um, and well maybe Oslo, I don't think we're quite going to Norway right now um, and you know, no other cities. In the Nordics we are currently learning that we have to have a different size view on the markets, that we have to think more relative than absolute, not an absolute in, in inhabitant numbers when you look at office and, uh, and at retail and residential up there, more on the relative size of cities, which means how many percent of the population are living in a city. And if you look on, on this side, on some of the, the, the Swedish cities, for instance, you end up that cities like Gothenburg, Malmö, which everybody knows, but also Linköping, Jönköping are sometimes relatively more important than cities like Freiburg in Germany. A lot of investors will go for retail in Freiburg, but if you go for them and say we go for retail in Linköping, they will tell you we don't know the city. But relatively speaking, the city is more important for Sweden than Freiburg for Germany from the population size perspective. So that's what we, what we currently try to do. Mm -hmm. And also when, we, when you look for, for Denmark, where we looked at Aarhus and so, some other Odense, some of the smaller cities for, for high street retail uh, properties, because we think that's one of the, the things to go for. In Norway, actually, we would like to go. But the question is, the market is very quick in, in transactions. So the, the Norwegian investors have still a lot of money left. And the, then you, you need to have the courage of the investors without going any, any currency hedge uh, to say, yes, we go in there and we quicken our decision. And what we figured out so far, a lot of German pension funds and insurance companies aren't able to do a decision if you have a, a lot of investors in the fund within a week or two weeks' time. That is a little bit of uh, holding us back to go to the markets.